right, there is a lot of stuff happening in Eren right now. Uh, there are events, and there is one thing that's interesting. We're getting new skills. Uh, so I'm just gonna talk to Duncan here. Uh, yeah. Greetings, Eleonora. I'm glad to see you again. It's been quite a long time since you last returned to this world. I still remember your awestruck face when you first arrived. Speaking of which, you... Uh, okay, he studies my face. As you may know, many mysterious things happen in Erin. People don't realize it when they're new, but it seems you've been here long enough that you're finally experiencing benefits from Erin's natural protective energy. Palala shines, bright shines brightly, and the Eweka and Ladeka glow peacefully in the night sky. The sun and moons have protected Erin for eons. They say those with a will to better themselves are blessed by the sun and moons. The stronger the will is, the greater the benefit from their energy. Eleonora, as a militant who experiences many lives, you'll find the energy is weaker following rebirth, but eventually your body will reattune to Erin and you'll regain those benefits. After level 50, Moonlight of Eweka will increase your abilities. From level 100, you will receive the blessing of Ladika, the second moon. Breath of Ladika allows humans like us to move faster than usual. And the longer you stay in Erin, the better you can control the energy of Eweka and Ladika. Eleonora, it seems this world is embracing you as a part of itself. I hope you continue improving yourself through the natural blessings of Erin's moons. Never forget, you're a precious individual loved by this world. Aw, thank you. So, this is obviously on my main. And, as you can see, I'm level 88 right now. So, I've actually already got the Shine of Erika to rank C. Um... The way it works, as far as I've understood it, is you get it at, ra at level 50, and then it ranks up every 10 levels. So I need to reach level 90 to rank it up again. So as soon as I logged in after this update, I immediately got it to rank C. And I need to get to... I think the same is true here. It ranks up every 10 levels. So, that's interesting. Uh, and it's hidden abilities, so... And as far as I've been able to tell, there are different skills for the different races. So, the elves have another set of skills. And giants have another. I think... Now, I think this one's the same, and this one changes. I don't remember. I know this one changes. So, be sure to check it out on your characters, if you haven't already. You probably have, because I'm probably late with this, but... I thought it was interesting and fun. So there's that, there's the new skills. There's also events going on. So I'm gonna head to Dumby next. See you soon. Alright, here we are. So these are apparently Chocolate and Obel. I don't know who you are. But I'm supposed to talk to you. Hi, I'm Chocolate. This is my friend Bomb. -Bom. He's adorable. I was going through Stewart's bookshelf yesterday when I found this. It's a chocolate recipe that makes true love a reality. Okay. With a recipe like this, I'll have a fairy tale love life. 
The problem is I suck at cooking. Same. Even though I do it for a living. Don't make me do it at home. Uh, do you have a special someone? Did you get a gift already? If not, you should help me with my secret recipe. Okay. Get a gift. Is this a late uh, Valentine's event or something? It's an exciting day and love is in the air. I want to feel the love too. It's far too late for Valentine's. White day maybe? No clue. Uh, I want to feel the love too. But in all the books I've read, none teach you how to land a boyfriend. Of course, a terrible cook like me has a recipe to untru unlock true love. Maybe I should just break up all these couples. That'll cheer me up. I mean, I did find a recipe for that too. Ooh, that sounds like fun. You pick whichever recipe you like. I don't care either way. You can have the recipe that creates love or the recipe that destroys it. And whatever you pick, you can cook it instead of me. Interested? Oh yes, sounds fun. Perfect, will you be the main character? Yes. Promise? Your other friends won't be able to help you. Yes, I'm sure. Awesome, let me know when you're ready. I'm ready. Do I get... Oh... Get lots of event quest. Complete chocolate's daily quest eight times. Talk to chocolate and choose a recipe. Power of love, power of hate. Who are just who are you? I can talk to you? Okay. That's weird. I found a recipe that creates love and one that destroys it. Choose one. Oh, which one do I want? I'm gonna go with the secret hate recipe. That sounds like more fun. Uh, there we go. What do I get for these? Complete the daily quest eight times. Get a second title. I get do these five times. Get baby bomb bomb figure. What I get for this? Strawberry bomb bomb. I want the baby bomb bomb. So I guess I chose the right one. Uh Wrath Royal Castle Secret Hate Recipe. I can't read it. Okay, let's do this. Uh, gate hall, and I need to get to the kitchen. Uh, let's see if I remember. Oh, right. Let's see if I remember where the kitchen is. It's up here, yeah. I'm just gonna get you there. You need to run faster. Am I gonna have to use the cooking skill for this? Or is it gonna cook itself? when I get finished the recipe. I hope so. Because I haven't really focused on leveling up, ranking up my cooking. Uh, there we go. And drop the secret hate recipe. Let's do this. 
uh, info. 16 almond chocolates, 16 dark chocolates, 9 spoons of secret spice. Beat it with a fork for 5 minutes. Beat it with a fork? Can I beat the fork? Oh, okay. <laughs> Put the ingredients in the kettle to cook. Um. Okay. I think I might... Why are you... Okay, you're working. Do I need you... To... Hit the others? I do. To, uh, oh, no, wrong, 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 wrong weapon. Octopus, that's not something I need. Um there we go. Are you helping me? You stick things. Come on. There we go. So I've got a limited amount of time in here. I need to get ingredients. And they're not dropping them. You're not dropping the ingredients I need. Or are you? Oh! They are! They're putting it there. Come on. This is ridiculous. Come on. You should be dropping more than that. What do I need? 1669. Got another chocolate fondue stick. Put it there. Just in case I need it. Come on. Okay, I got one secret spice. Hey! Stop doing that. 
Some of these are aggressive, some are not. Come on. I've only got six minutes left. And I need five minutes to beat it with a fork. I'm not gonna make this. If I actually need to act do that for five minutes, or if I just need to do this and then I'll automatically get those five minutes. Why are you suddenly using magic? Come on. No, you don't. I'm not very good at this, I should say. I want to be able to do, use my ninja skills on these guys because it would make everything so much easier. Come on, just die already. Thank you. What have I got? Five, three, three. This is not gonna end with me actually doing this. I'm pretty sure. There you go. I think these guys are actually fighting for me in a way. Come on. Okay, so maybe I don't actually need to have all the ingredients and five minutes left. I'm just hitting everything in my path right now. And hoping it dies and drops things. No stamina. Great. Come on. Great. Come on. Three minutes left. This is not going well. No. Come on. Just be done already. Stop attacking me. There we go. I've actually got seven almond chocolates. I still need all of them, so... Come on. Come 
on, come on, come on. I wonder why we need to use these specific weapons to do this, because it's taking far too long. And that doesn't hurt them, I think, at all. Oh, it does! Do I just need to have it equipped? Is that it? No, because the skills themselves doesn't hurt them. Come on. Then again, not every time I use this they don't get damage every time I use the regular skills either um congratulations um battle result you burn the cake that is not how cakes are made you made too little great chefs don't skimp on ingredients I was trying I'm gonna try that one more time. Now I know what to do. Uh, now I know what to do and I have more of the recipes. So hopefully I can get started quicker this time. I need one of you. Okay, this time it went even worse. I'm not sure what I'm doing wrong, but it didn't look like it actually started dropping ingredients until I only had about six and a half minutes left. Which is weird. So I'm gonna have to check this quick, real quick. Okay. Let's try this one more time. Okay, so, uh, what a mess, you couldn't even bake a cake. So I finally got something out of this mission. I'm just gonna let you go home. I got a little more, but... I didn't finish it. So I still need to fi figure out how to finish it. Um, okay, so this time I got... Uh, you burn the cake. That is not how cakes are made. You made just enough. Um, I almost got 
Uh, I would have needed two more dark chocolates. But apparently, and it's failed, but apparently, I think I figured out a good pattern to use. I'm gonna try that for the final one. Okay, I need to get up here. Come on, come on, come on, let me, let me, let me, let me beat it with a fork. Come on, let me, let me. It wouldn't let me. Okay. And away the mission failed. And I'm out of recipes. Since I'm not, I haven't really done the food dungeon before, I'm not actually sure what I did wrong. So if anyone has any tips for me when it comes to this, uh, you can tell me what I'm doing wrong then please feel free to do so. Uh, I appreciate any tips. Anyway. I didn't get to finish this quest, but... I'm gonna have a new try tomorrow. Because I think I can only get the recipes once per day. So I'm gonna try again tomorrow, and yeah, we'll see.